everyone, my name is Tegwin. In September, I'll be going into the final year of my undergrad at U of T. To be honest, the elevator pitch for what I study is that there is no elevator pitch. We need a long walk at best to cover as many facets of design, professional writing, IT, data analysis, and project management. But the good news is that my program is exactly what landed me my internship at Mars. So rather than trying to explain what I did this summer, let me show you. In May, I was fortunate enough to be placed on the talented Mars Data Catalyst team. Wait, wait, that's not how I started. That's how I thought I'd be starting. I really started here. So I was fortunate enough to be placed on MDC with my main job this summer being to lead the development of our first annual scale-up council report. This report was on behalf of Mars and two other hubs like Mars, which are Invest Ottawa and Communitech. The report was intended to be delivered to FedDev Ontario, which is essentially a body of government that gives us funding for ventures. In the past year, we three hubs have implemented a five-year scale-up platform to support our scaling ventures. The platform helps us to achieve this by accelerating the means by which the hubs can share resources, tools, learnings, and notes. There are also a few long-term underlying goals of the platform, those being to increase the number of $100 million revenue companies, create more jobs, support companies to scale up, and assist numerous emerging sectors in Southern Ontario. We just finished our first of five years in the Scale Up program, so this report was generally communicating our progress on these goals to date. My involvement in the report development was largely that of project management, so that looked like communicating and compromising with several different stakeholders, building timelines and working around schedules, and being the person that everyone came to with questions. On a bit more granular of a level, I also did data analysis from these wonderfully condensed data tables that my team put together. This data analysis assisted with the part of the report that I loved the most, and that was its design. I started by picking a color palette that is print and photocopy proof, as well as colorblind friendly. Then I opened up InDesign, picked my page size, and had my fun. We wanted a clean, minimalist interior, so most of my design energy went into our report's data visuals. I really enjoyed making these, and if any of you ever have to, I recommend you consult this data visual... visual? This sounds really meta, but it seriously helped me this summer to utilize visual types beyond the beloved bar chart. While this report occupied the majority of my time this summer, it would be an oversight not to address the many other things that made my internship. As an ode to the data-loving team that I'm on, I'm challenging myself to show this to you the data way. But not that data way. My gift back to you, Martians, is to liberate your eyes of Excel spreadsheets for at least the next 10 statistics. This summer, I worked on one main project and collaborated on two others. Went on 29 coffee dates. Journaled 47 pages of things I learned, people I've met, and advice I was given. Learned 33 new business acronyms. Taught one virtual tutorial on data visualization. Forgot to invite two people to a meeting. Got called Tiguan twice, and I won't call anyone out, but you know who you are, Adam. Lost three rounds of the quarantine cup. Styled 23 unique work mullet looks. And played 87 rounds of the Google Chrome game when my internet was being unstable.